Good morning, hot dogs, and welcome to Hot Dog Network's Daily Announcements. We have a lot of interesting stories today, so let's see them after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Happy birthday goes out to Cruz Beltran, Nicholas Bryant, and Cadence Young. We have updated news about Twin Day. We have two, or shall I say four, winners for Twin Day. Shout goes to Heather Massengale and Anna McIndick. Also, another congratulation goes out to Miss Lovis and Miss Ulrich. Good job, peeps. Yesterday was Superhero Day, and congratulations goes out to Mr. Jagger and the rest of the students and staff that participated. Good job on saving the day. Also, tomorrow is Blackout Day, so make sure you wear your blackest clothes and bring your brightest smile. SAD is sponsoring April Awareness Week to motivate FHS students to keep going. Today's topic is healthy habits. It's never too late to fix those habits that bring you down. So, make sure to try getting eight hours of sleep eat fruits and vegetables, and just overall being your best you. Now, to sports and weather. Good morning, dogs. Yesterday, the Lady Dogs faced North Montgomery here at home. Sydney Whitaker could take the loss for, the, for Frankfurt, pitching seven innings, allowing nine hits, eight runs, and striking out 11. Justine Thomas led the hot dog on offense, hot dogs on offense, going three for four with two RBIs and one stolen base. Zoe Westerman went two for three, with four stolen bases, Kareem Quinones added one hit with two stolen bases. Terry Martinez added one hit and one stolen base. Heather Massengo added one hit and one stolen base. The girls traveled to North Montgomery later tonight for game two. Game starts at 5.30. Also last night, Frankfurt girls tennis was defeated by Lafayette Jeff, one and four. The Lady Hot Dogs tennis team is back in action Thursday, traveling to North Montgomery to face the Chargers. Matches start at 5 p.m. The varsity baseball team defeated a very good North Montgomery team last night, 8-1. Ryan Valdez was dominant on the mound, throwing a complete game for the win. And Nicky Hosa caught a good game and led the offense with two doubles and three RBIs. The Dogs traveled to North Montgomery later tonight for Game 2. The game starts at 6. Last but not least, the boys track team placed ninth in the Noblesville Invitational. Top individuals were Logan Wills, 6th in the long jump, Sam Michael 8th in the 100-meter dash, Aiden Hudson 7th in the pole vault. Edwin Wayne Scott 8th in the pole vault. Good job to them. The track team is back in action on Thursday, traveling to Clinton Central for County. That's all for sports. Not at Eli. Thanks, Nelson. Come in day is a very chilly 32 degrees, with winds only being around 5 miles per hour. Today is expected to be the most sunny day of the week. When we get out of school today, it will be a nice 52 degrees. It'll top out later tonight at 5 with 54 degrees. It'll start to cool off going down to 41 degrees. Tomorrow, I expect clouds with it being high 50s to low 60s. Now let's send it back to Pedro. Ivy Tech is offering free summer classes to any high school student, including graduating seniors. If you have any questions, you can look in the chatter. Also, there are only 40 copies left of yearbooks, and they are going fast. You can order online in the chatter. Books will be delivered before graduation. For lunches today, lines 1 and 2 are breaded chicken, and lines 3 and 4 are loaded tater tots. That's all for the announcements, hot dogs. Like, subscribe, and smash that bell for more notifications. Have a good day, dogs.